Hi, welcome at this video about a sneak preview of Arch Linux B open box. So we have now phase four. That's all ready for you to try out. We can download ISOs or you can build ISOs. That's the idea. That in a few months time, then there will be updates and improvements and then you build your own ISO. The idea is also to include the stuff that you do want and to exclude elements that you do not want from the Arco Linux ISO. So that's one thing, you can skip making an XFCE Openbox i3 ISO, but you can also decide, hey, let what the heck, let's do this, build your own ISO Openbox, and you have this look. So it's everything is possible, there are three ways now to install Arco Linux, Arco Linux. Arch Linux D and Arch Linux B. So this is the B. These are the D guys. And on our website, ArchLinux.com, you have all the information available for learning phase one or XFC OpenMox i3. And where can you download everything? At the download button here. They have two ways to, or two places to go to. Here is the Arch Linux and Arch Linux D ISO what we call simplistically the big one and the small one. And these guys are the new guys. So the Arch Linux B ISOs and every desktop we'll visit, we'll make a script and we'll make sure that you have ISOs available to download. Okay, the sneak preview. So OpenBox, this is just OpenBox that we launch. We have no other desktop uh, available. And you should see that up here to the right. We have here just one element here and let's log in VirtualBox will figure it out that I have a bigger screen than that it's often it's sometimes not often it sometimes happens so if this happens on another desktop what you do is log out and then LightDM says oh look I have more space and then everything is fixed and you log back in so a nice tip so um, yeah, Plank is, is waiting for, for, for it to, to boot you. It doesn't like logging off and logging in and then it, it pops up, but later. Right mouse click. So we have this open box thing, a terminal, and we have here 6.8.3. So open box, right. We have here Pamac up, to, up here, and there he is, the Plank, and XFC, and here, um, Sorry, the, so the variety I want to say, and let's change it already. So we have this wallpaper selector. Let's take something new maybe. No, it hasn't downloaded anything yet. So he will download stuff for you. I'll provide it, it come from, will come from desktop, or you'll see it in here. And the rest is okay. So maybe an OB menu generator icons. People love it that the menus have icons. And again, here we have this uh, HP that is all blue. You know what the drill is. We have a, a shortcut and only not a shortcut. And uh, some, in some of the desktops, we do have a shortcut in the settings, but it's nice to know what to type as well. Pseudo hardcoder fixer, that's it. And then if at some point in time, we get updates in and with Arch Linux, that's the whole day. You will have to rerun it if you see, hey, one of the icons is again um, colored, not following the design. Whatever icon theme you choose, it doesn't matter if it's Sardi or Surfen or Numix or Papyrus or anything really. It will not follow the theme you select. It's simple as that because of the hard-coded path to the image. So what you need to do is uh, run the script. So if you want it back, I rather have it with pipe menu like this. It reacts a little bit faster since it doesn't have to load everything up as well. Need to know information about this release. So this is the web page to figure out what Arch Linux is all about. And uh, we're mainly Arch as you can see. 90% is coming from there. We have a learning path for you and this is phase four we're working in. And um, well, yeah, if you want to download it, you can do it here. And if you want to donate, you can do it there. 
do read this page there is uh, there's this for instance will provide help so frequent asked questions known issues and their solutions is typical that you are asking the same questions that hundreds of people have asked before so we have put it in the frequent asked questions in the forum all the info things that people that uh, people ask it's gonna be probably in there so do check now we're just a small community um, but uh, often we you have something very specific on hardware and well there you can go and check out all the other Arch Bates based distros because it doesn't matter if we are on Arco Linux or on Tergos or Manjaro the hardware is the same the problems will be the same because we're all Arch based Discord for uh, to chat and so on well you can read the rest so this is your information and if you want more information about ArcLinuxD.com, this is a page you should read build your own ISO what we provide you is a choice we can we have freedom we give you full control of what goes on your article Linux ISO full control right so do check it out so sneak peek review this is uh, more or less it I mean we can edit some conkeys we could add some conkey as well to the system let's sort down let's go all the way down and then maybe the information one, blue one, red one, doesn't really matter which color, Eric just chose a conky. So there you go. And then what else? Some preferences, XFC appearance, termite appearance, slim appearance, all kinds of things to set your wallpaper. You can set it with nitrogen as well. If you hate variety, there is a tutorial how to get rid of it. And if you just want to say, I want this one, and then you have that one set so lots of possibilities lots of tutorials on arcolinux.com you'll find all what you need about uh, the information of um, open box because this is that's what this is open box and um, i would say enjoy our system and enjoy the freedom of having three ways to install arcolinux all right cheers